We got history. Got me feeling the nostalgia when you look at me. Thinking about what could have happened or what could have been. Finally, your face, I know it, that a sight to see. Take my time to take your clothes off one more time. Back at again with another H2B and family video for you guys. If you're new, welcome to my channel. And if you're old, welcome back. Thank you for joining my channel and sticking around and joining my crazy family that you don't hardly get to see. You just see my crazy behind, but either or, you see them when you see them. But um, I'm kind of upbeat today. I told myself that I um today I'm off. Um, didn't plan to be off, but I chose to be off because yesterday was a little episode for me. Um, just want to let you guys know that I was diagnosed with uh, anxiety, depression. Um, it's been this way for years. I was so in denial about my anxiety, depression um, until my father passed away in 2014 from schizo. Um, before he passed away, he clearly told me that I needed to go get checked because he sees some symptoms in me that he used to have um, as far as um, anger, as far as getting angry so fast and ready to latch out at people. Um, so I, when he when he told me that, I was in denial. I was just like, Dad, I'm fine. Ain't nothing wrong with me. I just, people just act dumb. You know, they're dumb. And after I sat and talked to a therapist, I felt much better. So let me stress to you guys that don't be ashamed of going to speak to a therapist because getting all that that you might have inside you that you beating yourself up and that you're holding on to, talking to a therapist feels so good. When I tell you guys, I got my glasses on because I can't really see far away. So I know it's a glare in my glasses, but try not to pay that no mind. But um, talking to a therapist felt so good for me. After I left out of there, I felt like all the burden was off me. Like I got out everything I needed to get out. Now I do need to go back. I haven't been back ever since 2019, but I do need to go back because I feel like some things are starting to trigger again. And I don't want to be that type of role model for my kids. I have two boys. Um, I gotta make sure that I'm strong for them um, and, and set a good example for them because the world that we live in now, I'd rather them be taught by their parents than be taught by strangers out in the street because people out in the street will lead you towards, even some family members might lead you to some danger too, but it's best that parents tell you before you hear it out in the street or you take that choice to do it out in the street. Um, so I, at the end of the day, I just want to be a good example for my kids. And I feel like I need to go back and speak to a therapist. Um, and maybe this might open the doors for my oldest son to feel comfortable talking to a therapist as well, because um, he, do, he does suffer for, comp he suffers from emotional depress depression um, and um, comprehension and I just want him to know that mommy and daddy is always going to be here for you so never be ashamed of what you have to do to better yourself um, we have to start speaking to our kids and you know guide them in the right path and not just telling them what they want to hear tell them the real deal I don't never sugarcoat nothing for my oldest son I don't never sugarcoat, sugarcoat nothing when I'm talking to him, I'm talking to him like he's an adult. Even though he's still 12, 13, whatever, I don't care. I, I talk to him like he's, so he can know the real deal. Because that world out there is tough. And it's better you toughen up from your parents than get it from out there. Because out there is more brutal. So, but anywho, so today's vlog will consist of, like I promised you guys, and I did a short video for you guys this self-care jar now i got this idea from tiktok um if you guys are not on tiktok please go subscribe and or go follow or go sign up to get on tiktok so many ideas that you can get from tiktok i got this idea from tiktok and um if you already on tiktok be sure to follow me here goes my name right here i'll put it on the description or in the link below um Follow me on TikTok. I'm selling on TikTok. So that's where you will get 
all the silliness from on TikTok. I'm silly on here too, but you'll get all that from on TikTok. Um, and if you haven't, follow me on Instagram. All my positivity, my motivation, my determination, all of that is on Instagram. Um, I try to do a morning motivation um, message for everybody because you never know what people's going through and they might need to hear that. It might just be for them. Um, not in trying to encourage you guys, but um, if you want to try to be better and live better, try to start doing certain things different in your life. If you feel like certain stuff is not working out, try to do different things, go in different patterns. Like, I mean, try different patterns, avenues, and whatever you want to do. Just try something different that you haven't done before. Um, live life um, is basically what you need to do. Um, trying to think what else. Um, but either who, so like I said, I promised you guys I would do this self-care jar project with you guys and that's what we're going to get into then i'm going to take you guys with me to walmart because i have to get a budget book and a planner um i'm going to encourage you guys to do that as well i always kept a planner with me and this year we are in 2022 so i need a new planner and i need a new budget um the budget book will probably be new for me i never did a budget book but i want to make sure that my finances my financial state is good so that once again, like I told you, I'm not going to keep saying it again. I'm just going to claim it so that I can purchase soon. Um, so I want to make sure that all my finances is on point and I'm doing the right thing and take it from there. And then after that, after I come from Walmart, then we're going to wash this nappy hair of mine. You know, look at it. It's wow and crazy. Like me. I'm wow. I'm crazy. I'm wow. I'm crazy. I'm wow. I'm crazy. I'm wow. I'm crazy. It's like, nah. All right. So let's get into this video. is the end result of it i hope you guys like it i did popsicle sticks because i wanted to be different um everybody else is doing um sticky notes i chose the sand in, in the jar and the popsicle sticks different color popsicle sticks and all this came from dollar tree hope you guys like it this is my self-care jar 2022. All right, stay tuned. We about to go to Walmart, aka Wild World.
it was the right amount of money that they had on the sticker. This is cute though. But it's the Pioneer woman and she normally costs a lot of money. I'm gonna double check that. It's a kind of little scanner thing. I cannot find a good planner. I don't want a little planner. I want a, a big planner. And what I mean about little planner, like these are little to me. That's a little. I don't want a little one. I hope I don't leave out of here with no planner. Cause I can't run away here for a planner. I'm very picky when it comes to planners, y'all. So, you gotta bear with me. Right. I'll get back to you guys. Let me check real quick. quick stop at my big sis house she had to give me something so now i'm going to show you guys what i got from wild from wally world aka walmart for those of guys that don't know that's what we call it here i don't know what you guys call it but we call it wally world but it's walmart <laughs> so let's see what i got of course i had to get some baby food for a little man um for those that don't know, my son just turned, my baby boy just turned one years old on Christmas Day. And I'm trying to wing him off of baby food, so I'm introducing him to finger foods. Um, I know a lot of people said you're supposed to start him early, but I I didn't start him early for some reason. I don't know why. Um, I have, like I said, I haven't had a baby in 11 years, so my oldest went a little bit fast for me, so... I totally forgot when I started my oldest on finger food um, and all this other stuff, but I didn't start my baby boy on finger food yet, but um, for the past couple weeks, he has been eating, um, uh, what is it, Chef Boyardee uh, beefaroni. He has been eating that. Um, my mom said he is eating spaghetti today from Chef Boyardee, so... He's slowly coming along, but he is off of formula, I can tell you that much. Um, he's on whole milk, so thank God that's a blessing because formula was a lot of money when you're not on, um, when you, I just got on Wick, so Wick came about towards the end when I was getting ready to wing him off a of formula onto whole milk, so Wick didn't make a difference anyway. I was paying out of pocket anyway, so, um, but formula formula is a lot of money so i suggest some people need to take i think bro when you want to if you don't have no kids and you want to have kids i'm gonna throw the dust at you throw it at you i hope you have some but for me my cutoff was 35 i'm 36 so i ain't having no more so i'm gonna pass my blessings on to you guys whoever want to have some whoever's on my subscriber listen don't have any kids and you want to have kids here go my dust i'm throwing it to you but um anywho this is his food i got him a lot um it's more of uh fruits than anything but um i did get him these little meals hope you guys can see it got him some oatmeal So we're gonna try these out for him. And I hope that he can he likes them and he, he eats them. So. so like I said, that's his food. Set that to the side. And what I actually went to Walmart for was a planner, you guys. You see that? 2022. Look at it, and it's big, y'all. What I asked for, what I wanted. So, I got that to the I got this for my co-worker. It's One Minute with God. She's a Christian type of person. 
So I think this will make her day. Um, every day it has some type of word from the Lord or no scriptures. I'm sorry, scriptures in here. And I, I think she would adore this. So if you guys want to see it, it's one minute with God. I got me some to try to help my hair, my skin, and my nails. If you guys took these or know anybody that took some of these, drop the comments below and let me know if these work. I'm trying to get my hair a little bit longer. It is healthy, but I want it to be a little bit longer. Um, what I need to do is actually start trimming my ends, but like I said, I'm scared to do it because I feel like I'm gonna cut my hair. I'd rather go to a salon, but a salon will cost an arm and a leg just for you to cut your ends. They wanna wash and dry your hair and then cut your ends. They don't wanna just cut your ends. So, anywho, let me know if anybody took these. So I got these for me. It's a lot of um milligrams in here too. A thousand. So hopefully that works. Um I've been hearing a lot about this. So if you guys on my, my channel um heard of this I don't know, say the name. Hope you guys can see it. Rice water. I heard rice water is good, period. Um I'm gonna have to try rice water one day just from scratch not man-made i want to do it from scratch like actually the rice sit you know put it in a little uh spray tube and then do it myself i want to do that one one of these days but um like i said if you guys heard about this product this product drop the comments in below and let me know if it works <sighs> all right this for sure i definitely use um it works good on my hair this is a uh, Carol's daughter. I get the almond milk. It's the shampoo and the conditioner is definitely good. Let me know if you guys use this, but I could tell you and I could recommend you this is good for my hair. When I say it's soft, it oh, gives it so much bounce. It works good for my hair. And Last but not least, of course I had to get some of this for my the my little water dispenser or whatever diffuser oil dispenser. I had to get lemon. Lemongrass is has your house smelling so good. Of course, remember I told you guys I'm gonna try to do this planner, this budget planner. So this one I got. This is what it looks like. It breaks it down. Monthly spends. Pray for me, you guys. I'm going to do it. And then I got this wellness journal. This is what it looks like. It got the habits. It got the goals. It got the breakfast. It got the self-care, act of self-care, act of kindness, lesson, lesson learned today. Today, I am grateful for daily affirmation. I'm going to try it, you guys. This is what it looks like. I'm going to show you. Try to jot down your goals, your self-care, and all this type of stuff. I understand I did the self-care um, jar project. But still, jot down all your your goals and all your stuff. Try to get in the habit of doing that. Um, it works for your mental as well as your soul, your body, and all that. So, and that's all I got from Walmart. So let's get ready to wash my hair because um it's going on three o'clock and sooner or later my, my baby boy will be here. So come with me to wash my hair.
all right this is the end of the vlog right here i'm straightening my hair as you could see earlier it was wow i was looking like don king's little sister but <coughs> but i straightened my hair and it's oh my god it's so soft it feels like oh god it feels like silk but anyhow this is the end of the vlog if you like <coughs> if you like what you say don't forget to hit that subscribe button like comment below hit that post notification button every time i hit every time i drop a new banger uh i don't know i just got a taste of the dry air and <coughs> now my throat is <coughs> dry i need some water but um anywho so until next video i will see you guys soon and you have a wonderful night and a good weekend. And I love you guys. Good night, H2B and family. See you in the next video.